Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Essential Albums video. We are on week six now, and this week we are looking at the Spice Girls' second album, Spice World, released November 1st, 1997, um, with a few notable tracks being Stop, Too Much, Spice Up Your, Spice Up Your Life, and Move Over. I actually own this album twice. I have um, the regular vinyl here, which I got, I want to say, beginning of last year, about a year ago. And at the end of last year, they released the 25th anniversary uh, deluxe edition. Has the same album songs as the first album with a few like remixes. And I think there's like a digital version that has even more uh, remixes and things like that. I was really torn between doing this album or their first album. So Spice, which I actually own as well, has my favorite song on there from them, which is... Uh, Say will be there. I love that one. And then um, my second favorite song from them is also on that first album, which is Who Do You Think You Are? But um, just thinking about it, I think I actually just like this album more overall. I think the other songs on the album are generally stronger than the other songs off their first album. For example, uh, Spice Up Your Life. We have the back of this one here, which is the original. Um, or it's like a reissue, but original uh, list track listing here. So Spice Up Your Life, pretty good song. Um, I think I like it more than Wannabe. Wannabe, I think, just got kind of got like overplayed at some point. It kind of, um, it, it was kind of like their first major hit, but then I think it got just like overplayed. I got kind of tired of it. Um, so, so we have Spice Up Your Life. Next up, we have Stop. Stop is probably my, like in my top five, I think it's like, I don't know exactly what my top five are. I think... It's first, it's Say You'll Be There, uh, Who Do You Think You Are, um, I guess Stop Too Much, and then um, Stop It Too Much, and maybe one other one I can't really think of, but uh, Stop is just a really good song, and then it feeds right into Too Much, which is just another just amazing song by them. This lineup of Spice Up Your Life, Stop and Too Much might be like their best three songs, three song run in any album, so those songs are all amazing. Um, then it goes into Saturday Night Divas, which is pretty good. It kind of gets overshadowed by some of the other songs, but it's really good, though. Never Give, Never Give Up on the Good Times is just a fun song. It's, it's it's serviceable. It's good. Move Over is fun. It's a shorter song, but it's a pretty good one. Uh, Do It is fine. Not my favorite. Do It and Denying are probably the weaker songs on the album. So it goes Do It Denying. Uh, then Viva Forever, which is really good. And um, another one that I didn't like at first initially, which is uh, The Lady is a Vamp. It's weird because it feels almost like it's off a different album because it's a very like old like it's kind of like old timey they're doing like kind of like trying to do like a throwback and it doesn't really fit the entire the vibe of the rest of the album i don't think so for a while i didn't really like that song but it's kind of grown on me a little bit over the years but um but this one like i said like beginning of last year picked up picked up the 25th anniversary i have spice on vinyl as well um, I don't have Forever because I, that's just one I haven't gotten around to buying. I'll probably buy it at some point just to have the collection. Um, and I don't have the 25th anniversary of the first album because I think they, they did a 25th anniversary edition and then they did like five different other colored vinyls, each one like cover with each of the girls on it. And I was like, well, I don't want to buy any of those because I'm then going to want to buy all five of them. And uh, for a while, so I was probably going to buy the the posh one of that and then the sporty one. But um, I ended up not getting any of those because um, I think for a while, like, Posh was kind of my favorite, like, personality in the group. But, like, the more I've listened to them lately over the last, like, year or so, I've definitely really, I think Sporty is probably my current favorite. And I think her voice is just, you know, like, the best out of the five of them. Um, so this album, it's just a lot of fun. Uh, some people might, like, use a term like guilty pleasure in this kind of album, which is, it, I guess it fits. It's, a very it's a very good solid uh pop album and it's not very long like I, it's like a i listened to the entire album today to kind of be able to discuss discuss, discuss it today tonight i mean and it plays very quick it's not a super long album it's maybe i don't know the time you got two like two minutes here three that's like six ten fourteen maybe up to twenty twenty two twenty four twenty seven thirty two Maybe only like maybe even just like a little bit over, over half an hour. So it's 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 short, but all my songs are pretty solid, even the ones that aren't amazing. And like I said, um, the lady is a vamp is kind of like doesn't really fit the vibe of the movie, or the, the movie. The, the I guess it fits the movie as well. It's a Spice World movie, but um, we're talking so like there's like on this 
25th anniversary edition. There's a few different remixes. So there's like a few different like Step to Be and things like that. Step to Be, Stop, which is a remix. A remix of Too Much, a remix of uh, Viva Forever, and then another extended version of uh, Step to Be. So Spice Up Your Life, Stop, Too Much. And then there's like the digital version has even more of those tracks. But um, been a fan of them for uh, quite a while. Like I said, probably going to pick up the third album at some point and hoping they do a a tour at some point if they, they ever get scheduled worked out and... Like, I know Posh doesn't really want to do a tour, so, like, I mean, like, I'd be fine with them just doing the four of them. I think that's what they did last time. They did, a, like, a small European tour not too long ago, well, a couple years ago, but, um, or a few years ago now, because it's been three years, I guess. But um, it would be really cool to just go to one of their concerts, even if it was, is without Posh. Like, I guess, like, it would be much more weird if one of the other people wasn't in it. Um... Because I know, like, I know Jerry left in 1998, and then eventually, when they, they kind of came back in 2007 for their greatest hits, and then they, um, they've they been trying to do a tour, or at least they claimed that they wanted to do another tour, but then there's just, you know, pandemic happened, and then there's, like, scheduling, and other, like, some members of the band not wanting to go, and what have you, but um, that is going to do it for this video, so then this has been Spice World by the Spice Girls, second album, um, very close to my favorite album from like I, I like their first album like quite a bit but this one I think just is track by track is a better album overall but uh, that's gonna do it for this video remember to like comment share and subscribe we'll be back again next week with another album thanks again for watching take care and have a good one